Hey guys, Rob here with EY Gaming. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the brand new Streamlabs game overlay. So the game overlay is a really nice feature that allows you to see your Twitch chat and your events on the same monitor that you're playing the game. So this is a really great feature for people that are streaming with a single monitor, but even for people that are using two monitors, it's a nice feature that you can check out and obviously it can potentially save you some space on that second monitor you're using. So in order to set this up, you want to open up your Streamlabs and go to the settings in the top right, and then you want to go down to game overlay here if you just tick enable in-game overlay now you have a few options here for customization so you can have it to show chat recent events and you can also toggle the positioning mode so positioning mode allows you to basically move around the screen where your events are going to show so obviously you don't want things blocking the actual game as it will be covering that uh, you can change the opacity as well which does help so I'm gonna put that down to 40% for this if you want you can just have the chat or you can just have events it's kind of there for you to customize however you want and then once you've done this initial bit of setup you're going to need to go to hotkeys and you need to set up a toggle for the in-game overlay and also the positioning so for this i'm going to do Control o for the overlay and then Control p for the positioning so if we press done on that Control p you can see it now disappears if i now go into my game and hit Control O. You can see there on the left and the right, I can see the chat, and I can also see my most recent events. If I hit Control P, I can then move these while in the game. As you can see, it's a really nice little feature. And then I have to hit Control O again. The opacity is probably something that you'll wanna play around with and see what works best for your stream. If we go back to overlay now, I'm gonna turn it back up. Kind of depends on the game you're playing, what's in the background. And then we go back to the game. And you can see there it shows up. Now as you can see, I've now switched to full screen mode and that has removed it from my screen. I believe this does work in some certain games, but at the moment the best way to do it is just to use full screen windowed. So again, it's kind of gonna depend on the sort of games you play and whether you need to play them in full screen or not. Um, but overall it's a really nice feature, it's something that I think is going to be amazing for anyone that's using sort of a, a smaller streaming setup if you're just using that single monitor. Um, this pretty much eliminates the need for a second monitor other than being able to see like dropped frames and that sort of thing. But I imagine they will potentially update this in the future to include some extra features like that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure you leave a like. If you have any questions about the overlay or any other Streamlabs features, then leave a comment below and I'll do my best to have a look at them and help you guys out. Other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.